yards if they had to. Oh, big right hook by Pacquiao and a left hand, and Solis is in some trouble. And there goes a push by Pacquiao. He's trying to muscle his way in. Solis has been hurt here in the sixth round. Excuse me, I said the fifth. I meant the sixth. This is now the Pacquiao that I think everybody expected. Magandang araw mga pre. Mayong adlaw po sa mga Bisaya Adya. Bago natin simulan. Kung bago ka pa lang napadaan sa aking munting kahanan, suporta naman. Click mo lang subscribe button at notification bell button. Palike na rin ang video para lagi kang updated sa mga bago kong uploads. April 14, 2007, nakaharap ng ating pambansang kamao ang undefeated na Meksikano na si Jorge Solis. Para ito sa pagdipinsa ni Manny Pacquiao sa kanyang titulo na WBC International Super Federate Title. Bago ang nasabing laban sa presko ng dalawa ay sinabi na ni Solis na si Pacman daw ang tinuturing na enemy number one ng Mexico dahil sa pagdomina nito sa mga alamat nilang pambato gaya na lang nila Eric Morales, Marco Antonio Barrera, Oscar Larios, Emmanuel Lucero at Hector Velasquez na puro tinalo via KO. Kaya sa kanilang laban ay bitbit daw niya ang bandila ng Mexico at tatapusin daw niya ang paghari ni Pacman gamit ang kanyang mga kamao. Sa mismong laban na may pamagat na Blaze of Glory ay bitbit ng challenger ang undefeated record na 34 wins, 0 loss, 2 draws, 25 by a knockout. Habang si Pacman naman ay may kartadang 43 wins, 4 losses, 2 draws, 33 KO. 5-8 itong Mexicano habang 5-6 lang ang ating pambato. Ginanap ang bakbakan sa Alamodom sa Texas sa Amerika at sa mismong gabi ng laban ay naging maaksyon naman ang ipinamalas nila. Kahit mapapansin agad ang diferensya ng height nila, ay di ito naging hadlang para kay Pacman. Agresibo sa buong rounds, andun talaga ang pagiging halimaw niya pagdating sa mga basagan sa ibabaw ng lona. Umabot lang sa 8 rounds ang salpukan, panalo si Manny Pacquiao dito via 8 round KO. At sa interview na ginawa nila, ay nakapagtataka at medyo nakakatawa ang sinabi nitong si Jorge Solis sa media. Mas malakas pa daw ang suntok ng kanyang asawa kumpara kay Manny Pacquiao. Dagdag pa niya. Napakabilis lang daw talaga ng mga kamao nitong ating pambato at di daw niya nakikita ang mga ito. With respect to Manny Pacquiao, my wife hits harder. He is very fast, very quick and I didn't see those punches. Kung hindi malakas ang suntok ni Pacman mga pre, bakit kaya siya natalo via KO? Pinatumba siya sa luna, di lang isang beses kundi dalawang beses pa. Halilat sabay nating balikan ang maaksyon nilang bakbakan. Sa mga unang rounds, makikita mo talaga ang diferensya sa height nila. Patangkad talaga itong Mexicano kumpara sa ating pambato, pero di ito naging problema kay Pacman. Andun pa rin ang pagkaagresibo na tila kahit anong minuto ay gusto agad lapain itong kalaban ng Mexicano. When you step up against the Pacquiao, it's a whole man handle it beautifully with Solis, fight the same way or will he up. So far, you know, I, I think Pacquiao yeah, yeah, looking for a chance to attack as he always does. Cautious at all times. If I have to finish you off. But Solis has to offer. Manny Pacquiao, who due to the machinations of the F at 130 pounds, and he's generally considered probably the best at that weight class, if not Juan Manuel, my number one. I would like to see Jorge Solis pull that rock from Pacquiao. Pacquiao gets him against the rope. Close first round. Solis. How do you feel him? He's strong. Yeah, he's good. I, I believe that Solis did win that round. In round number two, of course, it's a scheduled 12 rounder. And Solis getting a little wild and awkward in there. And that won't bend. Here, I believe that uh, Solis should have thrown a left hook when he saw Manny Pacquiao go in it. Important punch for him, we all know. Circumstances of which he's trying to do now outside of boxing. Uh, but I believe one of those outside interests. He said, I'm not campaigning. Obviously, I, when I'm training, I, <laughs> it's a lot of extra pressure. <laughs> Just seconds remaining here in round two. A better round for Pacquiao, probably. Although Solis, their landing the jab has had his moment. That's not another thing that I can do. Reminder that round three is coming in the white trunks. Of course, the great champion in both the uh, junior lightweight division and down the junior featherweight, taking on Jorge Solis.
Yeah, he just connected a couple of good shots right now. This fighter just hasn't used it enough, and that was the weapon he wanted. Now, he's such an exciting and excellent fighter. He makes a lot of fundamental errors. He squares himself oh. up to against the, the Eric Morales's, uh, Juan Manuel Marquez, and Marco Antonio Rivera. Hard for them even to take advantage of it. Certainly so can. Combination downstairs by Jorge Solis. Solis being a little more active than he was. So just seconds remain in round three, and again, Solis is an elusive target. That punch that you were talking about, Gennaro, that's probably the best punch of the round right here by Pacquiao. It was kind of at the end of the punch, though. So it, 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 didn't... it would. Oh, there's a left hand that sends Solis down. Oh, oh, the point. At dahil din sa headbutt na to, ay parang nagising ang natutulog na halimaw sa loob ng katawan ni Manny Pacquiao. At sa mga sumunod na mga rounds ay dahan-dahan ng nilalamo ni Pacman ang lakas nitong kalaban. The scorecards, if they had to. Oh, big right hook by Pacquiao and a left hand and Solis is in some trouble. The hurt here in the sixth round. Excuse me, I said the fifth, I meant the sixth. This is now the Pacquiao that I think everybody expected to see. And this is what I expected to see. So Lee's right here trying to avoid, trying to get away from punches and getting hurt because he doesn't pick up his hands. That clash of heads and the cut over the eye woke up Manny Pacquiao. He Solis just ripping shots on the inside. He's, he's trying desperately to finish the fight. Maybe he's a little bit more worried about the cut than we think. Well, he should know. They'll go to the store. Oh, Big hook good. by Solis. Good. Up wow. a cut out Yeah, well, this is starting to look like the typical Manny Pacquiao yes. war, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Let's hear. First, you see Pacquiao come in with his head. Boom. And that's certainly not an intentional butt. That is just, you know, an outgrowth of the two styles and the way Pacquiao comes in. Now you can see it happen again. There's a good right hand by Pacquiao. And the heads just rub together when they come into a clinch. Solis coming right back. Now he's resilient. He did recover quickly. He got hit with some good shots by Manny Pacquiao. Solis has a tendency to fall inside, especially if he throws his right hand, and that's why the hits keep coming back. Two left, left hands hit hurt Solis. Well. Two good straight left hands got him in trouble. The two KOs that Pacquiao has had have come within six rounds. And all of Solis's KOs have come within six rounds. So they're in territory where a minute left to go or just under it in round seven of this 12-rounder. Good jab by Pacquiao. This is our main event of the evening, and there's another one of those big left. Both of the soft cars, they tweet to lead to the right when they're getting ready to throw that lift. I'm surprised that Jalisa is not high on to that. Seconds remaining here in round number seven. Danny Pacquiao has had himself an excellent seventh round and lands yet another short left hand. Well, round seven was about 90% Manny Pacquiao. There's a big left hand. You see that it... Uh... Round eight. Basag na ang ilong nitong undefeated ng Meksikano Pero matapang din talaga Tuloy pa rin ang nakipagsabakano Ay nalasap naman ang unang pagkatalo Mula sa alamat nating pambansang kamao Kayo mga pre Anong masasabi mo sa komento ni Jorge Solis Na mas malakas pa daw ang kamao ng kanyang asawa Kumpara sa kamao ni Manny Pacquiao Ang inyong komento Reaksyon at suwestyon ay welcome na welcome sa baba. Here's the end of the fight again. Double left, there's a jam, uh, straight right, and a left to finish it off. Manny Pacquiao. The WBC International Super Featherweight Champion, Congressional Candidate, Manny Pacman Pacquiao. Bisitahin nyo rin ang YouTube channel ng mga kaibigan ko mga pre na sina Philippine Sport History, Boy Astig PH, Usapang Sports at John Boxing TV. Gumagawa din sila ng mga video na siguradong magugustuhan ninyo. Maraming salamat sa panonood at suporta mga pre. As always, ang Pink Permi.